Hello everyone, welcome to the Lion Hermit Crab Educational Center. I just wanted to make a video on how to um, prepare your marine salt water for your hermit crabs. Hermit crabs do require two types of water um, that need to be available to them at all times in their tanks. Um, I, I use Instant Ocean, you can use Reef Crystals or you can use other uh, brands that are marine grade salt. Um, those are safe to use. We cannot use sea salt. Sea salt is not the same as instant ocean or reef crystal. It's not the same as um, marine salt. So we want to make sure that the salts that we're using are safe for our hermit crabs. Um, I just wanted to explain how I mix it. So it's half a cup of marine salt per gallon of water. Um, I like to dissolve my half a cup into um, one big cup of hot, hot water. And I just stir it and let it sit for a few minutes before I add it to my jug. And then I just fill the rest of the, the jug with um, uh, faucet water. You want to make sure you're using tap water. We're not using bottled water. Bottled water do, does not have the minerals that tap water does have. Our hermit crabs need those minerals to be able to thrive. Um, so we want to make sure that we're using tap water, not bottled water of any kind. So we are going to, um, we mixed this already and you want to make sure that before you add your um, water to your pools, you are going to prime them. Prime is just um, a dechlorinated drop which removes um, heavy metals, um, ammonia and chlorine. Those things are harmful to our crabs, so we want to make sure that we are using these drops when we add them to our pools. Um, so it's one drop for anything less than a gallon. So if you are pouring your gallon of water into a dish um, that is small, that is less than a gallon, then you want to make sure you're just adding one drop. If you are adding one gallon water to um, to your pools, like my pools are one gallon, so I am going to be putting two drops. So it's one drop for anything less than a gallon and two drops per gallon of water. So prime needs to be added every 48 hours. If you have um, standing still pools, um, if you don't have any bubblers in them like I do, um, these are bubblers, bubblers you can find in the fix in the fish section in your pet stores you can't even find them on amazon i have filtered um bubblers so they are small filters so i don't need to prime only unless i am going to be um topping off my pool so if i need to add more water to my pools then i'm going to add a drop of prime to those pools now if you have pools with just bubblers and not filters then you're put you're going to prime your pools every 48 hours um, the reason for this is because the company states that prime only um, works um, to remove ammonia every 48 hours after 48 hours the ammonia resurfaces so we want to make sure that that doesn't happen ammonia can burn your crab's abdomen and they can um, can do quite a bit of damage so we want to make sure that we are doing that hope you guys enjoy the video if you have any questions please feel free to ask